Hello, so this is day 50 with our public harness. I just thought I'd come on here and just do a quick demo of how I change Max's nappy. Um, I've been seeing lots of um, comments post up in some of the um, hip dysplasia groups in the last few days from um, people just starting out on their journey asking questions about nappy changes and it actually was one of my um, main concerns when Max first went into the harness. I really couldn't quite work out how I was meant to change his nappy and I did express that um, on some of my sort of first few videos um, and somebody actually commented very specifically on one of my videos asking um, if I had any tips for nappy changes so I just thought it'd just be easier just to come on and, and just show. Um, I'm going to do the best I can, I'm not going to fully change his nappy, um, I'll sort of just show how I do it and how I get prepared um, to do it um, and then we'll just go from there. Um, so the one thing I would say is just make sure you're prepared. So I always make sure I get a nappy out, all the wipes out and everything like that. Um, what I do is I unfold the nappy fully. So I pull out all the tabs um, and everything like that because I find if you don't do that, you're then fiddling. Um, and the last thing that you want is any leakages, especially in the harness, because it, firstly it's white. And it's not that easy to clean and you don't want to take it off or you can't take it off to put it in the wash so you really need to avoid um getting anything on anything um so if it's just a wee um i don't generally do anything with the booties however if i've checked and um, max has done a poo i always cover the um booties with just a poo bag so this is one that i've used already and i just reuse them i just essentially just tie it up over the over the um foot so when he is thrashing about um it does just protect the booty and it does take longer to change the nappy because you can't lift them up all the way or like roll them over in the same way that you would normally change a nappy so you very much got to sort of like scoop them from underneath and while you're faffing with that you don't want to be worrying about feet being dipped in poo so that's generally what I do with with the nappies um sorry with the feet um so with the nappies I like I said I make sure everything's pulled out I even sort of um pull out the the tab section so not the sticky section but the first layer of the tab so I get that done so I obviously take um the baby grow up as far as it can go pulling it all the way around the sides um, and I think the biggest issue is just feeding the nappy underneath the strap so um, one of the tips I picked up really early on is actually upsizing in the nappy so um, go for a slightly bigger nappy size than you generally would just so then you get much more stretch so you're not really trying to pull it super tight between um, the, the straps that was just not working for me um, so I lift Max up um, so do obviously the dirty nappy first um, and to get the tabs out I always just double fold the, the tabs back so that nothing's sticky and then just literally feed the tab through the strap um, and that means it stops it getting all caught to itself and caught to the straps and stuff like that so that's the easiest thing I do. Um, and then so to put the nappy on obviously I, I lift him up and I put the nappy under and then I essentially um, um, tab the tab, you know, pretty basic, obviously, and then feed it through one side. And then I literally just stick that first tab anywhere. I just put it anywhere um, because you're not going to get it in perfect place, first of all. Um, and then you can then just do the same on the other side. And then just literally put that one anywhere and then now you've got the tabs stuck down underneath the straps and you're not fiddling with that at that point you can then go in and adjust them um so so it fits right um because i find when i was um, changed mats before he went in the harness or when i sort of changed my older one i literally just one go strap over one go strap over but i just never found that worked with the harness like it just was too too tricky to get it done first time so that that is basically um what i do um and i know to some people this might just seem really really simple but to anyone that is literally day one day two of having their harness this stuff is what gets you and um, i found myself getting really emotional um in those first you know couple of days because i was like i can no longer change my son's nappy i don't know what i'm doing anymore i feel like a complete failure it's a bloody nappy like it catches me even now thinking about it thinking how i felt back then um so just 
sort of these basic things um i hope just might help someone um so yeah so then obviously like i said already time to do it, i just um tab the sticky back down and then just feed it through um and then obviously as you're you're wiping you're constantly um trying to keep everything out of the way and then i sort of like scoop everything into the old nappy um and then at that point you can sort of lift them up and then start wiping um the, the underneath um you know with my um old son and max before i'd literally would grab his legs lift him up like this and then wipe all over um but yeah that is completely out the window um i know lots of people do things different ways some people may even just take um the, the, the legs out and all stuff like that to do their nappies but um i've been super cautious the whole time we've been in the harness um i don't take it off unless it isn't within our hour and even before we had that hour i never took it off um in its entirety to dress him or anything like that and it served us well you know who knows what would have happened um if i did take it off it could have been the exact same but it could not have been um but yeah that's sort of just a, a really basic basic tip that's probably not going to be useful to some people but even if it's useful to one person then um i'm happy but yeah um cool catch you later